I am Antonio Briseño from Venezuela. This work, yeah. it is a research I started uh, six years ago, uh, the year 2001. It's called The Gods of America. At the moment, I have here pictures from Peru, uh, Panama, Colombia, Brazil, Mexico, and Venezuela. It is a very uh, big work that has already around uh, 60 pictures. This is a it's a long-term process. I will still work in some more countries like Argentina, Chile, Guatemala, also United States, Canada, because I want to cover the whole continent. But there is enough material now for a serial like this, so we have made that exhibition at the moment. I was very much interested in the printed images of the gods or the saints from that cultures. And then I wanted to do a work like that with the indigenous group, but they don't have, uh, they don't have it graphic images. So my idea was exactly to propose the images for the gods in, a, in graphics, in printing. So I am also a biologist and I am interested in nature and all of the, the gods are gods of nature, natural gods. So I want to, in, in that way, I want to represent the, the relationship they have with nature, which is very important for me because they have a very quiet life with conservation with the environment and they live in very different places, uh, different kinds of environment like the Amazonian forest or the Andean mountains, the deserts, the Caribbean Sea. I am also trying to choose all the different kinds of environment for, from the continent. Indigenous groups are normally uh, very apart from the western uh, cities or the western culture. I need someone to, to make the link because I have many friends who work in conservation projects, anthropologists or biologists and uh, they are, since they are living there, they are very helpful for me because they introduce me to get there. If I don't have that link, it takes long time. For instance, in Mexico, I spent six months uh, to make my work, but the first four months I couldn't make any picture because they they refused. So normally I need someone who make the link for me and it is much easier. Sometimes I can stay only 10 days, 15 days in the community and that's enough time to make my work. I like to stay longer. If it's possible, if I have a scholarship or if I have a grant, I can stay longer. But sometimes I have been only 10 days and it has been enough. What I always do is I send the pictures to them with my friends or with the contacts I have uh, because I am representing their gods. So I want them to see and to, to, to know what is the reaction, if they like it or not, if, if they find that those images could represent their gods. And normally they do. Normally they like it and they, 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 they agree with the way I, I use the images. I give images for the schools also and for every person I have made a portrait, I send the pictures again. The importance for me is that very few people know that there are many cultures in the continent that they are still alive, they keep their culture, they keep their, their traditions and the importance for me of this work is I want to show to the world that there are, they are still there, they have a very good relationship with the nature and we have to respect them and we have to, to be proud that there are so many beautiful and powerful cultures in, in the whole continent. Before this project I, was, uh, I used to do only uh, documentary photography. It means I didn't make any, all of them are made in computer. Before that work I didn't make digital uh, treatment of the image. It was just the picture as I, sh as I shoot it. Uh, I also, I was working about devotion because it's something I like very much. So before doing this work, I was, as I told you, making that work about the holy sacred images, but also the religious festivities in Venezuela or in Asia or in different countries. Uh, normally I have uh, choose a subject like the bazaars or the, the mosques, the, the traditional festivities, and then I make a, a documentary work. But this is a special work for me because it takes quite a long time and it will take much longer. So it's the first time I, I do a work for in long term like this. The shamans and the books are also help for me because every god is different. 
So I tried to put in the image the, the most important features of that god. It is especially in the background. Uh, I may tell you that here is a god of a storm, so I have to put the storms in the background. I also use some other elements, it's mainly in the background that you can find the, the important elements for the portrait. In the future, it will be growing, so we'll include more and more cultures, so it will be more complete. It is my aim that after five or six years I could go from the pole to the other pole.